Hey guys and girls, my name's Alan and welcome to today's video. Never would I have thought this time last year that I'd ever reach this milestone and as you can probably tell from the title of the video and obviously the thumbnail, this video features my 1000th victory in Fortnite Battle Royale and I thought I'd mark the occasion by trying something I've never attempted before and that is to do it in a solo squad. As you can tell from the followers target on the screen, this was actually recorded last month and I've been sitting on it for a while because I had some other videos I wanted to get out in the meantime and there were some videos that sort of were relevant to the events that were taking place at the time, like the ICE event for example, so I didn't want to put this one out when I had those to put out and then it would have been weird to put those out before um, the event finished, so that's why I did those first. So really at the point of posting this video, I've already gone past the thousands mark basically. Now, as I said, I've never attempted a solo squad before, and this wasn't my first attempt. Um, I decided to do it on this particular evening because the squad weren't on, and I tried it a few different times beforehand. I didn't specifically set out to get a high kill game because I don't think I'm that good, but I wanted to get a match where there was at least some action. Um, so I landed in certain places, tried to get a few kills, and it just it wasn't working out for me. I got a few kills, but then I kept dying like halfway through. But I said to myself, I wasn't going to land at like a dead place. I wasn't going to land somewhere really quiet. And I probably could have secured this victory a lot easier had I decided to do that because if I'd have landed somewhere like Junk or Lucky or you know somewhere like that completely dead where there's no players I could have taken my time, Lucy, got to the final circle, take on one or two teams and potentially walk away with the win. That would have been the easier way of doing it but I decided not to do that um, so I tried to land at sort of semi, not, obviously I wasn't going to drop like tilted and stuff all the time but I tried to drop places that weren't too far from the bus where one or two teams might go and I could sort of pick up the scraps and then just go from there. Um, I ended up landing at Fatal and Fatal was completely dead, there was no one there and it wasn't even that far from the bus so I was surprised that there wasn't anyone there and I was a little bit disappointed. I was hoping to run into maybe one team at the start, um, you know, get a few kills and go from there but there was literally no one uh, and by the time I actually ran into someone we'd gone down to like the final 20 players alive, um, that's how much time I spent just looting and looking for people. I, as I, said, I didn't try and hide or anything, I didn't sit in a bush for the entire game but I just wasn't running into people um, and so I spent a lot of time just looting, farming mats, getting weapons, didn't even get that much good loot to be honest with you. Um, I eventually ran into a couple of people and well I'll let the, the video play out, I won't ruin the result or anything but obviously I walk away with the win uh, but how I get the win, well you'll just have to wait and see. As you can tell, this was recorded from a previous live stream on Twitch and uh, unfortunately I didn't have a lot of people in the stream but there were one or two faces. Little shout out to Will who was there, I remember being uh, in the stream while I was trying to accomplish this and uh, we were just talking about just random stuff um, but it was nice to just have someone there for company uh, while I was trying to do this. I mean I would have tried to do it anyway even if there wasn't anyone watching, that's the whole point, I've already talked about this before. Um, I stream because it saves me a lot of hard drive space but I like interacting with other people so if there's anyone there then it's great, if there's not, well, I'm used to it and you know I, I still do what I do because I enjoy doing it so. I call this my 1000 victory but in fact it's probably more than that because I don't know if you remember but this time sort of last year the, the stats for a Fortnite Battle Royale they sort of just broke for like a couple of weeks so any wins that you were getting they just weren't being counted weren't being added so technically this is 1000 and something but because they don't actually show on the stats I can only show it's my 1000th win. A couple of weeks ago I was also on to hit another milestone, uh, my 300th duo win and I said to myself why not do something special for that so I thought I'd try a solo duos and uh, I recorded that video actually and I posted that a couple of weeks back so you can check it out, I'll link it on the screen now, also in the description below and it was kind of interesting because I was doing the same sort of thing again, I wasn't planning to land somewhere completely dead and just camp it out to the end, um, I was actually trying to get some kills and I actually got a couple of matches where I got a decent number of kills at the start but I just couldn't make it to the end. I kept going for it and eventually I did get my solo duo win. So that was my first ever solo duo win, that was also my 300th duo win and I said to myself why not do something similar for my 1000th win, um, which isn't my 1000th squad win just to clarify, it's just 1000 wins in general, but I thought I'd do something interesting for that so it's my first ever solo squad win. I've had to clutch out squad wins in the past, I've had a few over the seasons, so it's nothing that I've not done before but I've never purposely dropped into a squads game, no feel solo, just trying to do a solo squads. Um, so this is kind of a special bit of me. And it's funny because if you'd asked me a couple of years ago when I first started playing Fortnite, like uh, 2017 I think it was now when it came out, I'd have never thought I'd have reached this point uh, because it was so hard to get wins back then. Well, it was so hard for me anyway because, I don't know, I just wasn't very good at the game. I'm still not amazing at the game, but I'm, I'm much better than I was. If only I could have learned this stuff back then a bit quicker, I'd be so much better now. I never thought I'd reach a thousand wins, um, so that's that's crazy. Uh, but to, to see how far I've come over the years as well, um, it's, it's kind of cool. I mean I guess everyone was in the same position um, when they first started playing but I don't know, I just, it took me a long long time to adjust to Fortnite. I played third person shooters in the past like Uncharted 4 for example and I'm really good at those sort of games but for some reason Fortnite the whole building aspect was just weird for me, I'm not, I'm not really good at the building, I'm still not very good at the building if I'm honest with you but I'm in, I've definitely improved more than what I was before. 
and the shooting as well was just really difficult and I still struggle with the shooting to this day like despite how many wins I've got despite how many kills I've got I just I'm not very confident in this game and it's, it's really weird considering how much time I've actually played I don't know how much longer I will continue to play Fortnite, but if they keep adding stuff to the game and they keep updating the map, I think that's the thing at the moment. The map is really stale and they need to just change it up. And I'm hoping, obviously, with Season 8 coming out in the next couple of weeks, um, that that's going to reinvigorate the player base and uh, just get some more interest and just more stuff to do, I think, is, is necessary. More landing places, more weapons, that sort of thing. Um, and just changing tactics because we've had this season for a really long time now. It's been drawn out because of the fact that they closed over Christmas. So they extended the season for a couple more weeks. Which at the time when they said it, I didn't think it was going to be a problem. But having played the same map now, and it's not. A gr I'll be honest with you. I think season seven has been the worst season since the start of Fortnite, um, and I played all the seasons. So I, I, yeah, I, I do think that the game is due for a big shakeup, and I'm hoping that season eight is going to provide that. Of course, for the foreseeable future, I will still be streaming. Uh, so if you fancy watching some live gameplay, do check me out sometime. I play with the squad normally, or at least with a couple of friends or something like that. So we just have a few jokes, have a few laughs. Between us, we've actually got a really good win-loss ratio, so I mean, we might not always get like massively high kill games, but you'll be guaranteed to see at least one or two wins on the stream. So check me out live sometime, links on the screen, also in the description below. But that'll do it for today's video. If you enjoy the content, do consider slapping like button. As I said, pretty special video for me today, uh, my 1,000th victory royale. Uh, it's, still, it's still weird saying that. Like, to say I've actually hit 1,000 wins on this game is pretty mad. I mean, I, I've looked at some stats of some pro players, and I'm not trying to compare myself to them because I'm not in the same boat, I know that. But even some of those players don't have the same win-loss ratio as I do, and some of them haven't hit a 1,000 wins either. So if they're playing more than me and they have less wins, I mean, I, I'm pretty proud of myself because of that. But I put that down to having a, a good bunch of people that I play with. I mean, obviously, I, as I said, I can clutch out solo squads if I need to, but I don't really enjoy it because it just means that I have to play really conservatively. And I don't really like playing solos. That's why I play duos and squads. So if it weren't for the team that I play with and the people that I play with on a regular basis, I would never have hit this 1,000th win victory mark uh, because I would have just been bored and I would have stopped playing this game a long time ago. So, of course, a big shout out to them as well for helping me to get to this point. But yeah, that'll do it for today's video. As always, if you've got any thoughts, share me regarding anything I've talked about today or anything you've seen in the gameplay, do let me know in the comment section below. But until next time, thanks for watching, thanks for listening, take care, and I will see you later. Don't tell me Paradise hasn't been looted. Are you serious? Ah, oh, just watch. I'll run into the first team, just get clapped straight away. Whoa, okay, sunshine. <laughs> oh my god, that guy just got fucking smoked. Oh, well. Um, thanks, I think. Need to make sure I don't get hit by the same person. Oh my god. Aha. Oh, he's up there. I see him. Ah, gold spaz. Fantastic. Oh my god, that guy just got fucking nailed. Whoa! That close. Oh, okay. No, 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 no. of a dickhead.
What the fuck, dude? There's plenty of other people to shoot. Christ almighty. Okay, short answer is the nades did not help. Oh my god. Oh, storm's coming in, of course. I used all my. Oh, well, it's a good job I had the mats. Maybe in the guy that's hit the other one? I don't know. And of course they all rifted. Oh, please don't let it be a 4v1. There's a team over there, shoot them! I'm not hurting anyone. Oh Christ. Yeah, that's right. Shoot each other. Leave me out of this. So it seems like it's me and two duos, maybe. Take that jump out as well, thank you. No traps. Good. Whoa, 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 shoot the other guy. Oh, they picked his ass up. My 1,000th victory solo squad. First ever solo squad. Let's go! Oh my gosh. Let's go. <laughs> oh my gosh. I can't believe it. Well, thank you. Clearly you brought me a bit of luck. Oh my gosh. Let's go. Let's go. Nice. Oh, okay, it's a slow start. But hey, I think I handled the end. No, okay, it wasn't perfect. Got into two mini scraps and then that one at the end was a 1v1v1. Let's go. All right, so the all important proof. 24. 304972. If my maths is correct, that should be 1000. Feel free to check, let me know otherwise. And today's date is. Well, you can, you can see the store. Today's date is 18th of Jan. Oh, my heart. Let's go.